Here's another animal song. A year ago, last Thursday, I was strolling in the zoo when I met a man who thought he knew the lot. He was laying down the law about the habits of baboons or the number of quills a porcupine has got. So I asked him, what's that creature there? He answered, oh, it's a helk. I might have gone on thinking that was true. If the animal in question hadn't put that chap to shame and remarked, I ain't a helk. I'm a ganu. I'm a ganu. I'm a ganu. The nicest work of good nature in the zoo. I'm a ganu. How do you do? You really ought to know wahoo's wahoo. I'm a ganu. Spelt G N U. I'm gun not a camel or a kangaroo. So let me introduce, I'm neither man or moose, so gano, 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 I'm a gano. I had taken furnished lodgings down at Rustington on Sea, whence I travelled on to Ashton under Lyme, it was actually. And the second night I stayed there, I was wakened from a dream, which I'll tell you all about some other time. Among the hunting trophies on the wall above my bed, stuffed and mounted, was a face I thought I knew. A bison. No, it's not a bison. An okapi. It's unlikely, really. Could it be a hearty beast? And I seemed to hear a voice. I'm a ganu. I'm a ganu. A ganother ganu. I wish I could ganache my teeth at you. I'm a ganu. How do you do? You really ought to know wahoo's wahoo. I'm a ganu, spelt G N U. Call me bison or a copy and I'll sue. Gun or am I in the least like that dreadful hearty beast? Oh, gano, gano, gano. Gano, 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 I'm a ganu. Gano, gano, gano. I'm a gano.